the formula charges are calculated from subtracting the unshared electrons and the half the shared electrons from the valence electrons. Let's apply this formula to ammonium ion, NH4+. Ammonium ion has one nitrogen atom bonded to four hydrogen atoms. If we counted the electrons surrounding the nitrogen, you will find it eight electrons. According to the octet rule, atoms need to have eight surrounding electrons to reach a stable electronic configuration, except for some compounds where there are more or fewer electrons than eight. The formal charge for nitrogen is equal to five valence electrons minus zero unshared electrons. Now we can see there are zero unshared electrons surrounding the nitrogen. As for the shared electrons, each bond represents two electrons. So if we count the shared electrons, there are one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. There are eight shared electrons. So the formal charge for nitrogen is equal to five valence electrons minus zero unshared electrons and the half the eight shared electrons equal to plus one. For the nitrogen, for the four hydrogens, one valence electron minus zero unshared electrons and the half the two shared electrons because each hydrogen has one single bond which is formed of two electrons equal to zero. So there is a zero formal charge on each hydrogen. So the total is equal to positive one. This is the positive we usually see on the top of the ammonium ion. Let's try to assign the formal charge for sulfate. We have one sulfur atom singly bonded to two oxygen atoms and doubly bonded to another two oxygen atoms. Notice sulfur here deviates from the octet rule with 12 surrounding electrons. Let's distribute the lone pairs on each oxygen. We have six valence electrons on each oxygen, so I have here only two electrons. So let's write the rest of the electrons as lone pairs. One, two, three, four. So we have one lone pair at the top and one lone pair at the bottom. Now this oxygen is similar to that oxygen, so we have another two lone pairs. The top oxygen here has one single electron, so the rest of the six electrons, one, two, three, four, five, six. So we have one lone pair with one electron, so we have to add another electron. This is why we will write here a negative charge for the extra electron we added. The down oxygen is similar to the top, so we have another three lone pairs. Now let's calculate the formal charge for sulfur. Sulfur has six valence electrons, minus zero unshared electrons, and the half the 12 shared electrons equal to zero. The formal charge on the double bonded two oxygen atoms is equal to, we have two oxygen atoms, and we have six valence electrons minus four unshared electrons, and the half the four shared electrons, one, two, three, four, equal to zero. Now for the formal charge on the singly bonded two oxygens, we have two oxygens, so we will multiply by two. Six valence electrons minus six unshared electrons and the half the two shared electrons, one, two, equal to negative one. Multiplied by the two equal to minus two. This is the negative two we usually write on the top of the sulfate ion, SO4. Negative 2.